today we're going to learn about some beautiful zoanthids. This is a great coral to practice on. It makes a nice addition to your reef and it's easy to propagate and I think you'll really enjoy this project. I hope you're able to share it with some kids. Doing these projects are another way to make science fun. I'm going to show you a fun way to grow a lot of zoanthids and this way is kind of automatic. Once you get some zoanthid rocks ready, they grow right onto the other rocks and they are easy to harvest and it's a good way to make a new product that you don't have to constantly play with. We use a ring of PVC pipe and then we use a group of round plugs. The center plug has the fancy zoanthids on it and the outer plugs have no zoanthids on it at first. When this project is really going the ring on the outside gets covered with zoanthids and so you can have one color of zoanthid on the plastic ring and put a different color in the middle of the circle and then wait a while and their plugs will turn out to be combinations of those two colors. The fun thing is that you can take each of those plugs and make another ring so that when you're done you have a whole entire tank full of coral plugs ready for sale or trade. There are so many different ways to grow corals that each thing that you learn about one coral may lead you to an entirely new idea on how to produce a different coral. I think that zoanthids and palaethoa are one of the very best corals to have because they're so collectible and there's so many colors and there are new colors being brought into the hobby every week. There's a lot of different names and it's fun to learn about the names and follow them back to see how they got started.